In the high-stakes world of global superpowers, the military might of North and South Korea is a sight to behold, a riveting dance of strength, strategy, and survival. Two nations sharing the same peninsula, yet separated by a chasm of political ideologies. This is a tale of two Koreas, a tale of their military power. South Korea, officially known as the Republic of Korea, boasts a formidable military force. Their active personnel number over 600,000, a force to be reckoned with. They have a vast array of modern military equipment, from over 2,000 tanks to more than 1,300 aircraft. But it's not just about numbers. The South Korean military is renowned for their technological prowess, with cutting-edge technology like the K-2 Black Panther tank and the T-50 Golden Eagle fighter jet. Their defense budget? A staggering $43 billion. It's a testament to their commitment to maintaining a robust defense and ensuring peace and stability in the region. North Korea, or the Democratic People's Republic of Korea, is a nation shrouded in secrecy, yet their military might is no secret. With an estimated active personnel of over a million, they have one of the largest standing armies in the world. Their military equipment may not be as modern as South Korea's, but they make up for it with sheer numbers, boasting over 5,000 tanks and more than 700 aircraft. And their defense budget? It's estimated to be around $8 billion. It may not seem much compared to South Korea, but given the size of their economy, it's a significant portion. North Korea pours a considerable amount of resources into their military, a testament to the regime's militaristic approach. But it's not just about conventional warfare. North Korea is known for its nuclear ambitions, with several nuclear tests under their belt. It's a wild card that adds another layer to the intricate dance of military power on the Korean peninsula. So, there you have it. Two nations, two vastly different approaches to military power. South Korea, with its focus on technological advancement and a sizable defense budget. North Korea, with its emphasis on sheer numbers and nuclear capabilities. In the end, it's not just about who has the bigger army or the better equipment. It's about strategy. It's about resolve. It's about the will to defend one's nation. And in that regard, both Koreas stand tall, a testament to their resilience and determination. In the world of military power, the tale of two Koreas continues to unfold, a riveting story of strength, strategy, and survival. A tale that serves as a stark reminder of the intricate dance of power, the delicate balance of peace and war.